What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Jen here on a Friday, and that can only mean one thing. It's Sega Forever Friday, where I have the pleasure of going back through Sega's library of classics, and I get to play with you guys. You can download them along with me because they are free in the App Store, and you can see that we're playing Golden Axe right now. So hit the download button on your App Store, Google Play Store, and play along with me, and let's reminisce. Golden Axe, let's start that single player, and Golden Axe. I think my first exposure to Golden Axe was again through the Mega Games collection. I think it may have been Mega Games 2, where it had Shinobi, Streets of Rage. Um, it had five. It had the World Cup game in there. It might have been three. I don't know. I've got them upstairs somewhere. But um, it's my. That it was my first exposure to Golden Axe, and I didn't like it as much as Streets of Rage, but I liked it nonetheless. I like the mythology and the fact that I can put this life meter up to five, but shh, don't tell anyone. Because, you know, Golden Axe is a little bit more um, finicky in the battling. It's a little bit more, I don't know, stiff, I guess you could say, in the controls. And if you're too far from the enemies, they're going to be running and hitting you by default all the time. So we want to have as much life as we can. Um, Golden Axe has some of the, my most favourite, personal favourite music. Um, ever that I love to listen to especially the first level which we're gonna hear right now as we select the players we have Axe Battler we have Tyrus Flair and we have Gilius Thunderhead and that's who we're gonna go with because I like his headbutt his headbutt's pretty good but this is the music I love this is my favorite piece of video game music um, Death of Adda invaded the castle and has taken the king and princess prisoners my friend Alex was also killed in the battle to beat them and to bring peace to the land is my and yours duty. So let's get on with this straight away. We're thrown straight into the pits and you can see already the enemies are here. So we're going to be swinging the axe, picking up for the throw. Remember, if we get too far away, they're going to be doing, they're going to be busting out running, running hits. So what we want to do is uh, return the favor. So if we get rid of this guy, see you later. Ugh. Get these purple guys out of the way. Now, to be fair, I'm doing quite well. Um, we'll save the magic till uh, till the end, I think. But these guys got scarier in looks as the games went on. If you were to ask me what my favourite game out of the trilogy of Golden Axe games were, I've got to say this one, or the PS2 version. I'm really joking. Nah, -uh. the PS2 version. Nah, -uh. <laughs> no way. That thing was broken. That thing was broken. Um, but this is my favourite Golden Axe title. I just love the music. I love the simplicity of the game. Um, I love the the sprites. I love the art. This is my favourite out of the three. And uh, you can't you can't go wrong with that. It's very simple gameplay. Like I say, the the the, the um, Controls can be a little bit stiff at times, and the enemies can get quite frustrating when they're trying to charge you. So let's get this guy as well. Hey, 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 come here, man. Come, hey. Oh man, we can't get up there. He's gonna run away, isn't he? We can't get up there. We can't get up. He's out of here. We, we had a chance to get him, but uh, he's been a little rascal. So we gotta keep close to the enemies so they don't charge us with the running hits. And we should be going against the brothers right now. There we go, there they are. So if we uh, just take out these guys, remember, this guy's probably going to run. So we, we can narrowly escape um, the charge there. But now let's take on the brothers. Now he might go for a, yep, he might go for a bit of a blast there. I knew he would. Again, that's the only frustration I have with this game is the fact that you are too, way, too far away. They're going to be busting out. Um, their little charge attacks and it can be very frustrating especially when they're laughing like that but let's let's throw him over there and we got kicked and we died but we're gonna let's just finish them off here with a bit of thunder since we are Gilius Thunderhead and this should finish them off um, except this one over here so we'll finish them off as well and there you go stage one done and my favorite favorite little gimmick of the game 
and the little theme playing here. So you know how the theme goes if you are fans of Gone Axe. But I sworn enemy Death Adder is in his castle. We'll take the shortcut through the Turtle Village. So that's where we're going to be heading to right now. You've seen the sign during the boss battle. And we are on our way. I think this is where we can see some civilians running away from Death Adder's forces. So, the one thing I love about this game, as well, <laughs> is abusing the pits um, with the enemies. So get them to kind of like, if we go over here, and it's like, see you later, man! And it's like, no. Yeah, I just love abusing that. So here we go. They're gonna go for the charge attacks now. We need to be careful. Get rid of this guy. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. There we go. Narrowly avoided him. It's all about timing. Once you've got it down, it doesn't feel as stiff. But you're still gonna make. Ah! So who's who are they running away from? Who's scaring them? What monstrosity is scaring them? Ah, it must be the dragon, which is perfect because we can now. See, this is the thing. I'm on me dragon, and I want to stay on me dragon. It's going to run away in a minute, and I don't want it to. <laughs> but let me know in the comment section below, guys, your favorite Golden Axe memories, especially Golden Axe 1. Was it your favorite? Did you find it difficult? Do you think the controls are pretty stiff when you compare it to games like Streets of Rage? Um, but to be fair, this, again, um, the touch controls are pretty good for a stiff game like this, actually. So let's just gather these, uh, now this isn't really going to add to our total count here, but we'll do it nonetheless. So it's boss time, again, I love the short and sweetness of these stages, they do get longer as you go on, but we're against these two now, so we'll take them out. Though I do believe that we'll be seeing some kind of pink dragon that breathes fireballs in a second, because it makes you think that it's the end once you defeat these twins, these Amazon princesses. They are hacking away with us with their green axe, while we're with our silver axe on our way to get the golden axe. So they are shrugging and laughing their asses off at us right now. There you go, the charge. Didn't want to avoid it, I guess. But here we go, the pink dragon. So we're going to go that at skeletons mid-jump, not expecting it. Don't think anyone's expecting a bit of Thunderball. Um, yes, the skeleton is gone. And there you go, the uh, the fire breathing dragon. Now that'll be a great asset to us if we can get through this okay. No idea how long I'm gonna, oh, from behind. What a sucker punch. But there we go, stage two done, just like that. We could probably keep complete the game in a 20 minute episode. But uh, we do have the, oh this would replenish just the health, but we don't really need that. We could have done with that at the end of that battle. Really doesn't matter. Just love the music in this game. The village was on the back of a giant turtle. The turtle takes us south across the sea. So I think we will end the episode after traveling on the backs of these turtles. Now this is a stage I love because, again, everyone will be falling to their death. See you later, and see you later. Thank you very much. Ta -da! And we get ourselves a dragon. So let's not make the mistake of falling down. Let's see if we can get a running jump down. Here we go. Uh, right, okay. Well, right, I don't think we're gonna get. Uh, 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 come here. There we go. Oh, what a perfect place for it to land. Whoa, 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 we got him there, and we got him there, and we got... It's like it doesn't want us to get these magic pots. Right, I'm gonna have to... There we go. <laughs> continue! Yes! I want to continue. I want those things, though. There we go. Oh, man. The biggest fail right there. So what we're going to do is I'm going to get you to run over here. Come on. Come on. Let's have a bit of a run. Okay. Well done. 
Oh, we both fell. I didn't even realize you could fall off that bit. Oh, man. Oh, what a combo we've got down here. Look at this. Oh, God, God. Ain't taking me down, are you now? Right. I think we should be able to be able to knock this guy off. Throw him. Oh, we managed to get him. Oh, he hammered us in the head. In our Gilius Thunderhead. <laughs> but I think there, this isn't the end of the level. The end of the level's just after these two guys. Come on, I've got you both now. I've got you in the deadly combo. Oh, you're kicking me in the face! Is that how it's going down? Right then, there, that's you down. See you later, let's head for the boss. Oh, after we get these guys. Uh, don't really need anything from these. Oh, I need, one of, I need some of the greens. I need some of the green thieves. I always thought they were like, Demu like mutated turtle uh, snails, but they're actually really badly um, sprite thieves. But it's my favourite sprite of the thieves, if I'm honest. Right, come on, gold guys, you're going down. No, 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 no. Oh man, we're getting to uh, teaming up on me now. Right. Okay, you want to take me down like that? I ain't gonna go down like that, my friend. No, 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 no! Swinging my axe, throwing you around, throwing you. Are you gonna run? Yep. And you kick. Oh, not what I wanted. Right, you're down, and then you're down. Open that door. Reveal yourself, and let's get them. With the thunder. <laughs> I don't think it's. I think. Okay, it's finished off them, guys. This this boss is pretty easy to do. The, what you want to do is kind of come down at him because then he hasn't got the reach that he has with his sword if you attack him head on. So what you want to do is let him walk a little bit, go up as far as you can and then come down a little bit and then boom. And again, we want to go down. So we're a level with him and then come up to him and then boom, take that. I think sometimes, I don't know if he runs with his shield sometimes. No, he just hits with it by the looks of it. But that should finish him off. Nope. Okay. There we go. That's what I wanted to hear. Let's finish off this episode by getting everything we can from all four of these guys. So you're giving me some stuff. You're giving me some stuff. You're giving me some stuff. And hey, hey. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. So, as always, after I finish these episodes, I usually play the game until I get a game over, if I haven't already. So I am going to go towards the castle where Death Adder is. Um, you guys have been awesome for sticking around. Like I said, all your Golden Axe memories leave in the comment section below. And I'll see you guys next Friday for another Sega Forever title. And remember, if you want to play this, you can download it absolutely free on your respectable store that's itunes or app um, google play store go download it now you're not going to go wrong with it really to be fair and until next time i'll catch you on the flip side 